It's a great honor and it was always a dream, you know, to create these kind of events, you know, across the Atlantic Ocean in North America. And, uh, you know, I'm totally overwhelmed about what happened here. You know, we had hundreds and hundreds of people totally exciting about what we were, were showing to them. So, yeah, I'm, I'm, I think my English is not good enough to find the right words for that. I'm really, really, really totally proud of what happened. I was inspired to create the IMRS Intelligent Magnetic Resonance Stimulation by 16 years of experience with, uh, with this technology, by accompanying people who use this technology, by accompanying people who helped me to create you know, the next and the next and the next generation. And finally, we are at the time right now, the time is right, to launch this kind of technology which combines several ideas of uh, energy medicine in one little device. Um, and uh, yeah, it's, you know, it's, it's, I think it's the new era of energy medicine. It's, it's not the iPod yet, but it's the Walkman. Remember when the Walkman was, was marketed, you know, without the Walkman, we would not have this uh, entire uh, a nanotechnology of, of sound devices. And I think this is comparable with, with what we are doing. This new era of energy medicine, which uh, starts with the IMRS now, and uh, we will see where it's going to go in 5, 10, 15 years. It's going to be exciting. I think it's the right time now for the IMRS to bring it uh, to market worldwide because um, we collected so many uh, experiences over time now. Uh, I, I was counting, statistically, it's about almost 4 billion applications uh, with the last four generations of, uh, of the MRS technology with uh, so many incredible responses, so many incredible feedbacks from people. And, uh, and, and, and now, you know, we, we just have to do the next step. I mean, this is what we do. We are the leader in this market and everybody expects something from us. And uh, the, 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 the IMRS was a logical consequence of that, you know, to bring this technology on the market, to combine it with a technology which is also already well known on the market, you know, biofeedback, and, and, and this is, it's the right time to do it now. The in-home use of magnetic resonance stimulation is a value for people because we know it from a lot of applications which are available uh, either in the classical medical field uh, as well as in the holistic and uh, alternative medical field that most of the applications, they show the, 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 the perfect results if you're going to do it consistently. So it is very important that, that using this technology and taking it home, you have the ability to benefit every day without uh, investing uh, in uh, additional things like time or efforts because you just use it at home two, three times a day, even four times whenever you have the time. And, and this consistency leads to uh, incredible results. Um, and, and this is why it's so important that, that this technology can be taken home and can be used by everybody in the, in the comfort of their, of their house. I'm actually very excited what we built in the IMRS, in that, that little housing, you know, connected with all the applicators. Um, we called it intelligence because we, we built in several intelligent technologies. Uh, for example, our applicators are now intelligent, so you just plug them in and the system automatically detects them. You don't have to take care of which plug you have to use and uh, and and then of course uh, the 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 combination between between pulse electromagnetic field application which we already know from the from the uh, previous generations of our units and now the ability to to read something out of the body you know to to evaluate it and then to 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 give the body the right information you know to immediately adapt on that to respond on that this is intelligent wellness and that's why we call it intelligent wellness because we are now able to interact with the person who uses th this technology and give the perfect signal back what their body what their body and their their brain needs you know that's really exciting well, there is a paradigm shift going on on our planet it has to do with uh, with lots of changes in our environment it has to do with the uh, with, that we, we don't take care about, about our environment so much anymore, you know, and, and, and we lose more and more, you know, the contact between us and, 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 and our planet, and which leads to the fact that we have to face a lot of diseases nowadays, which were not known 150, 100, 150 years uh, before. And, uh, and, and so, you know, we have to look for additional solutions 
solutions with classical medical field uh, uh, shows us, you know, to, to, to prevent, you know, to create prevention, to protect us from this, you know, uh, 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 a problem which we have with our planet that we, that we are not, not attached anymore to, to our environment. And, and, and I mean, we need to educate people about that, that there, is, there, that there are things out which people can use easily without, without a lot of education uh, so that they are able to adapt to this new situation and they can protect uh, themselves from these changes which take part on our planets, which are tremendous. As you know, our environment is changing a lot because of the, uh, the fact that with the invention of electricity 130 years ago, uh, we've, we have to face a lot of, uh, a lot of new technologies nowadays, we, which, which would not be there if we would, have, would not have electricity. And based on that development, we have to deal with a lot of artificial frequencies around us, uh, which we are not designed to deal with because of the, the fact that we were born and raised, you know, and also uh, people in the ancient times with a natural environment. So, so you know, the thing is, our, our body tries to adapt, but, you know, the development goes too fast, so we are unfortunately not able to, uh, we're always running behind, let's say it like that, and, and therefore it is necessary to, um, you know, to look back to nature, to see what, what possibilities we have to take out, to take these natural frequencies and use the technology which we have nowadays to create artificial uh, uh, systems which give us back these natural things which we don't get anymore. And, uh, and this is the development and uh, this is the idea of, of staying healthy in the future or of creating a healthy environment around you when you're already not so healthy anymore to get it back. Our company, MediConsult, uh, we started our business out of Germany and Switzerland. And uh, it was not even my plan, you know, to, 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 to see the global approach with our company. Because, you know, nowadays it's not so easy with all the regulations in the world, especially if you talk about medical devices or, or, or technologies which are attached to the medical field. That can create a lot of troubles and uh, it's, it's, it's far away from, from being easy to market these, uh, these technologies in a lot of countries. However, you know, we decided about four years ago to approach the North American market just, you know, to, because there was a high demand and people were asking us to go there. So, in fact, we, we started and, uh, and of course, we, we were running through all these um, uh, glitches through all these troubles, uh, through all these challenges, but uh, we finally made it. We are here, and right now I think I can say we are market our device in, our devices in about 21 countries all over the world, and um, we have about two and a half thousand uh, health technicians representatives who represent our products uh, in these 21 countries, and we have a lot of demand from other countries already, which we just cannot fulfill at the moment because we have so many work to do within the countries we are, we are in. I mean, in the United States, there are 52 states, and as far as I remember, in 40 of these 52 states, we don't even have a representative yet. So there is a lot of work to do here in the United States, and we are ready, our setup is good, our administration works, um, so, yeah, that's, that's, we have a lot, a lot on the plate for the next 10, 15, 20 years. You know, there is so much feedback about this technology coming back to me according to what it did for people changing lives. Whenever I do a lecture or a certification somewhere, people come to me. Um, I was very impressed two weeks ago. I was in Boston, did a lecture there. Um, I was very impressed about people talking about Lyme disease. That was very interesting because it seems to be... A, um, an illness which is uh, which is very well known in this in this area because a lot of ticks are uh, in this area and and I had a lecture over 80 or 90 people and 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 30 of them were were, were telling me that the MRS d did tremendous tremendous uh, uh, effects on, uh, on 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 Lyme disease which I which I never never heard before because it was the first time that I, I was uh, lecturing in a in, a, in an area which was which seems to be uh, uh, very popular for this kind of uh, of uh, a condition, and there was a there was a, a young guy. He was about 16 years. He was in a wheelchair, and and you know I think he never he never attended a public lecture, and um, and he was he was talking about his personal experience. Um, he told the audience that he had absolutely no vision and he used the, uh, the technology, magnetic resonance stimulation, 
now for about three months and he get back already 20% of this vision. And this was, I mean, you know, I'm, I'm sure I can, I'm not even allowed to talk about that in the public, which I would never do. But, you know, this is what, what, what he said, you know, and, um, and that was very, very overwhelming for me. I mean, to hear that from, from a person in that age, that, uh, uh, that, keep, that should keep us going, you know, because uh, that gives us the confidence that we are on the right track with this technology. IMRS, MRS technology, right now we talk about IMRS because this is the newest generation which we, which we look at, is not designed to prevent, cure, uh, uh, diagnose any disease. Um, we are regulated with the FDA, you know, we have a regulation, um, so we are acknowledged, we can import this uh, technology into the United States. We will never make any claim, medical claim, um, so, so don't get me wrong with this, you know, if I tell you these stories, um, I was always, I am always, and I was always in the past very cautious about uh, presenting this technology because my first goal is to protect this technology and, and to bring it to the people uh, what it is. It is a wellness device because we work with natural frequencies, which we unfortunately don't get so much anymore around us. And that, that finally leads to these kind of effects, but it has nothing to do with the classical medical world. And like I said, I would never make any claim on this device because this is actually not what it is. It's a wellness device. And that's, that's what, it, what it was in the, in the past and that's what it is now and that's what it will be in the future.